We begin with breaking news from near Oshkosh this evening. Good evening, everyone. Confirmed just a few minutes ago, the single-engine plane, in fact, crashed this afternoon into a field near the state prison just to the north of Oshkosh. Two people were on board at the time. Now, Fox 11's Alex Ronaldo joins us live from the town of Oshkosh this evening. And Alex, you've been there. What can you tell us? Now, we're being kept a good distance away from the crash site. I'm currently at Vinland Street and Olson Avenue, but from here I can see there are fire trucks and other rescue vehicles lined up. Now, a small two seat plane crashed in the area of Snell Road near the prison. This picture was sent into our report it from James in Oshkosh. Now, according to the Oshkosh Fire Department Battalion Chief Jim Ostad, there were two people on board. Ostad says the pilot and a passenger were taken to a local hospital with non-life threatening injuries. The two men on board are middle-aged brothers from Kentucky. According to FAA records, the plane was built from a kit. Now, according to Ostad, the pilot was trying to land the plane on a small grass runway adjacent to Hickory Oaks campground. I be believe from our initial reports is that he was actually attempting to land here and just lost power at the entrance to the runway and uh, crashed at the beginning of the runway. Now, I did speak with an EAA spokesperson who told me the plane was not part of an AirVenture air show. However, it is unclear if the two on board the plane were heading to AirVenture. For now, reporting live in the town of Oshkosh, Alex Ronaldo, Fox 11 News.